Good morning, good morning. I'm here in beautiful Paradise Valley, outside of Phoenix, and it's such a lovely morning. Check this out. Hello, good morning, good morning. Today I am coming on to talk about day four of our Water Your Grass Challenge. And first let me ask you, I'd love to hear how this has been going for you so far, if you've been playing along. Just a quick recap of the week. Day one, we worked, we worked on our relationship vision. Day two, we worked on writing down everything we appreciate about our partners. And yesterday we worked on letting go of criticism. So today what I want you to focus on is um, allowing connection. And this is something that may seem simple, but the especially in long-term relationships, it becomes easy to turn away from physical affection. So for example, say your husband gets home from work or you come home from work. Do you guys make a point to go and connect? Or do you just go about busy cooking dinner, not look up, busy with the kids, not look up? Those simple acts of connection are very powerful. And maybe it's it comes a time, too, where your partner reaches out to touch you and you push him away. Um, over time, that really can cause a huge disconnection and your partner won't even make the attempt to connect. So I would urge you to, whenever your partner initiates um, you know, a touch, a physical touch, to reciprocate and, and be open to receiving that love. Um, of course, obviously in a consenting way, you know, but I want to, you know, just to be aware that pushing people away can, even if it seems little over time, especially in long-term relationships, can really cause a disconnect. So just be open to those loving gestures from your partner. And um, again, please, please let me know how this is going for you. Share in the comments below. If you think anyone else can benefit from this, please share with them as well. And I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Hope you have an amazing day.